Yeah, uh, and we're here with Aflac the Duck right now. Can you tell me how you felt about this experience? Out of all the stories that I've come across so far on the internet searching for content, this is probably the wildest or funniest title that I've actually seen. They're talking, like, oh, hold on. Man allegedly, the keyword is allegedly bench presses goose for 10 straight minutes at a Los Angeles park and it allegedly loves it. I don't even see the video of this. They don't even have the video of him actually bench pressing. This is just all I see right here. It's just saying like you see amazing things at LA. Yeah, you, you don't say. And this is the, like, this probably takes the cake right now. Well, I mean, Dr. Dre and Tupac said LA sure knows how to party. And to put things into perspective for y'all, this is back in 2012. This just randomly resurfaced on one of my YouTube pages. I was a stupid little freshman in high school when this was going on. Bruh, the way they titled this is just so funny to me because it sounds like they actually talked to the goose and interviewed it like they can read a bird's emotions or something. It was over there talking to Donald Duck like, How did it feel being bench pressed by a homeless guy? Over here talking about some. Reddit and Tumblr exploded yesterday with a photo of a barefooted man lying in the hillside of a somewhat crummy looking park bro all there is is grass i don't see anything else and it's like oh uh, you need to put some shoes on dude come on in response to the onslaught of questions he went on to imply that the man and the goose have some sort of relationship outside of you're telling me that a man and a goose have what, what was that one series with just like the strange addictions or something like a dude like loved his car or something so you're telling me that a guy no no what was it no it was uh Dang. Oh shoot, it took me many days to remember. It's fatal attractions, man. He's getting attracted to a goose. And try doing that with an ostrich. See how that goes. Oh man, good old classic Animal Planet, man. Y'all remember when they did those countdown episodes and like weird, true, and freaky and all that? That brings me way back. Oh crap, wait, I got a video to do. What am I doing? I guarantee you that this man doesn't know this goose. He just saw and just started picking it up and bench pressing it with one hand like, uh, look at me. Said over here that... The LA Park Animals has definitely given the Echo Park Goose Man a run for his money. Oh, there's another one? Another one. Are you for real? Is you for real? What are you trying to say? Is that what the Echo Park Goose Man's doing? Is he walking around holding hands with the goose? But bench pressing said Dr. Doolittle might call this third base. I call this crazy. Imagine going to your local park and you just see some random just barefoot homeless guy just trying to lift up a, a freaking a swan or something like that. Let's click on this link. The page can't... <laughs> It can't be found, seriously? Dang. Oh dang, they must have they must have put him in jail or something. Yeah, you freaking weirdo. And I can't even see the goose's reaction. Just that's a okay. Th this is supposed to be a uh, I, I say this anyway, a nicer channel, but like that's just a really really awkward angle, guys. Did you could you find a better angle to get the video or the photo? Where do people find this stuff at? Like th this is the only story of the the man and the goose and then that just sounds like a disney movie but like down here man accused of beating goose to oh dang that's dark that sucks i uh, hate to hear that oh dang man that was just recent and then here's a top gun workout that's pretty cool i guess but you know miles teller has a real workout plan this is i wouldn't call this a workout it's just goofy yeah gosh all goofiness aside i know it said that the goose allegedly loved let's just throw it in the quotes allegedly we're just gonna throw out allegations that the goose loved it like what if the goose hated it would it have flown away would he have just like went all crazy and started pecking him in the face like what would have happened then again i'm not a goose or an animal expert so i can't really read emotions like that i mean you can kind of read body language but like communicating with a bud nah and knowing how birds are wouldn't they more than likely have tried to fly away i mean i'm just saying like anytime i go near anytime i go near a goose they want to fly away like i'm just some ugly dude or something like eh, ugh, i don't want to be near him oh, it's such a sad crazy world we live in man i can't even go anywhere near a goose but a guy can bench press one that's crazy i mean i really don't know what else i'm supposed to say and do with this story i mean i pretty much covered everything i can think of i wonder if that dude was on drugs when he did this cocaine is a hell of a drug 